welcome back to 20 Minutes or Less. I'm Lee Newton. And I'm proud to be an American. Independence Day, otherwise known as the 4th of July. It's a holiday here in America in which we celebrate the adoption of the Declaration of Independence on July 4th, 1776. It's true. There was many people didn't know is that Gate Bitten was run by an evil band of velociraptors known as the Thomas Jeffersons. Nope. Nope. Yep. Uh, nope. Yep. No, during the American Revolution, the legal separation of the 13 colonies from Great Britain occurred. And after the Second Continental Congress voted for independence, they turned their attention to the Declaration of Independence prepared by the Committee of Five, one of them being Thomas Jefferson. That makes a little more sense. Although I'm pretty sure there were dinosaurs and some sort of tea involved. Okay, can you do me a favor, buddy? Can you take a nap? No, I'm talking about freedom. Basically, on July 4th, 1776, America finally became an independent country, finally free from British rule. Prior to our independence, Britain was a sovereign ruler over America, and British soldiers were supervising the land. Did you know that they made Americans pay taxes to the British? Boo! Down with taxes! Except for the rich, they should be taxed, and so should the poor, but not with money. You shouldn't, you know, I don't, shh, pss. Yeah, yeah, buddy. Lee. Yeah, Joe. Lee. Yeah, buddy. Lee. Yes. I don't. I don't know how taxes work. The Declaration says that the United States of America should have a government that consists of its own people, and that would work for the benefits of its own people as well. I mean, I think we tend to take this stuff for granted, the liberties that, that this document allowed us, the freedom of speech, the freedom to have our own beliefs and principles, the freedom to choose our own lifestyle. Freedom! I found another apple box. I'm Elliot! I'm Elliot! Oh, look at me! I'm Elliot! Sure, most of us think that the 4th of July is an excuse to just barbecue and eat various potato products and drink beer and watch fireworks, but it's not. It's the commemoration of a day that we broke free as a country and set out for a life that was our own. We have amazing liberties that we take for granted. We are a nation of 313.9 million people now. Why? Because of our forefathers. Yeah, yeah. Like George Washington, Abraham Lincoln, Teddy Roosevelt, John Lennon. John Lennon was not, I'm not even gonna get, I'm not even gonna get into it. We deserve the opportunity of life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness, even if that does mean that we celebrate that freedom every single year with beer, copious amounts of beer, barbecue, and fireworks. This fun fact about the Velociraptors in Great Britain, they hated fireworks, and that is why we celebrate with fireworks. To remember the ones that came before us and to shine on like a beacon of light in the night. The night forever free from the tyranny of Bitten. Could you imagine if they won and everybody looked like Hugh Grant? I don't want to look like Hugh Grant. Hey pal, can you do me a favor? You want to get some food in? Yes, I do. Okay. Because I have the right. So guys, what are your plans for the 4th of July and what freedoms do you love? Let us know in the comment section down below. And of course, click on that like and subscribe button. Click the annotation down below or go to sourcefed.com for our five daily stories and every other story we've ever done. I'm Lee Newton. I'm a Yankee Doodle Dandy. A Yankee Doodle Doodle Die. Three, four, six.